It's time for bookkeeping, beer, and BS. All right. So Melody, let's do a little uh, let's do a little dive into Melody's past. So people that don't know you, don't know how you got to homeserviceva.com. What got you there? Where did you like? Where did you start in this grand service industry that we all have so much fun in? I would love to tell you. So I started when I was 17 as a window cleaner for a family friend. Um, I hated it very much, but I wanted to what? save money to travel. Were you doing like, what kind of windows are you cleaning? Are you doing like residential? Are you, are you dropping mean, from the sky? Are you doing? No, like at that point we weren't dropping from the sky or anything. I I've never dropped from the sky. I do. I am boom certified though. So I love lift work, oh, cool. but, um, and actually I have one job a year that I'm going to do for the people who bought my company and it's a lift job because I love it. So keep me in the game, you know, you got dibs. But, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Actually, that's right. That job. Um, part of the cert, part of the buyout agreement is that Melody gets to do it. Pretty much, it's in, yeah, it's just written in the contract. Um, so I started when I was young. I kept leaving and then coming back because I didn't know who I was. But I always thought I wanted like to work in an office. It sounded really cool, and to be you know. And then I worked in office for three months one time, and it was like the worst thing ever. I got myself laid off because I asked, I kept asking, okay, I've done the work. Can I have more work? And I didn't know how to play the game, which is you pretend that you're working you while just you're look playing. Busy. Computer. Yeah, you just, yes. just got to look real busy. That's all. That was the first hard lesson. But anyway, eventually I realized I didn't hate window cleaning. I actually really like it. And I love the business side of it, figuring that out. I bought my boss's company. I sold that company in 2012, 13, but made another company. That's a long story I won't go into. And then just sold that and bought my friend's holiday lights business last year. That was part of the reason I sold the window cleaning because I love, love, love decorating. So not only holiday lights, I do weddings and proms. <laughs> nice, nice. You're and doing all the lights. Yes. And pressure washing we did for, with my company as well. So mm -hmm. over time I joined I, I got to a point where I just couldn't move past my own like you know I just had a real fixed mindset at a certain point you, I could only push through so far and mm -hmm. I joined um well I joined the Conquer group and that really helped me a lot and oh wow Conquer that's it's like Brandon <laughs> is my wardrobe Brandon has yeah. <laughs> dialed me into so many shirts that I like it's like what am I gonna wear today I'm like Obama like Obama I always heard had like a suit he had 20 of them, like, but he yeah, I was wearing the same suit. I just got 20 Conquer shirts. Thanks to You're Brandon Vaughn. You're successful because yeah. you know who else did that? Like Zuckerberg and Steve Jobs. I think they always wear the same clothes. So just wear Conquer every day. Just Conquer shirts. Thanks, Brandon. Yeah. Appreciate, the, appreciate the, the nice soft cotton. <laughs> and then, um, so through that, my coach Hedma, um, I had always done hired VAs through like Fiverr, stuff like that, but I didn't mm -hmm. do it on a like full-time basis. So she was like, you got to do it. You got to do it. And finally I did. And I turned out I was really good at that part because I'm good with people. I'm, I love employee stuff, mentoring, coaching, all that kind of stuff. And so um, I ended up selling the window cleaning business and realizing that I had eight empty months a year, I hadn't thought that far ahead of what it would mean to only have one business and not 20. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. Like, what, what do you do? What do you even do with all that time? I don't know. Raise my children, clean the house, do yoga. I don't know. That I couldn't like figure it out. So. Yeah, it sounds right. like a lot. So um, I asked Dean, who was watching, Bernadine, my partner, who was my first full time VA. To oh, partner awesome. up with me. Yeah. So she and I, she's in the Philippines. I'm in, I'm here. Mm -hmm. We have this magical relationship where we just really always got each other. Um, and we partnered up and we've been working on this since uh, it's about eight months now, seven months. We did a lot of beta testing and um, started really at the home. Con like we've been working with customers, but we have not been advertising. And so now is the time when we're like, okay, we feel pretty good about where we're at. We can start, you know, taking people on. Yeah. Like for in, in the real world. The real world. Um, but yeah, but it's so, something we really love doing and helping people. 